Hi, I'm Millicent Walker. Here's your Channel TV Evening News recap for December the 27, 2021. Some suspected political thugs have attacked the venue of the State Congress of the People's Democratic Party in Zamfara State. The suspected thugs invaded Zaitun Oil Mill behind State Pilgrim Board venue of the Congress in the early hours of today and destroyed the voting materials nomination forms, two vehicles belonging to party members and they also set canopies ablaze. Meanwhile, Edo State Governor Gordon Obaseki believes Nigeria's political system has failed the nation. According to him, the kind of politics played in 1999 is no longer relevant as young people are set to take over. Nigeria is going to a new stage. There is a new paradigm. The politics we started in 1999 has now expired or is expiring. So anybody who is playing politics the way it was played in 1999 cannot succeed. To security matters, Chief of Air Staff Air Marshal Oladayo Amao has reassured Nigerians that the Air Force will keep up its efforts to root out insurgents and bandits and all forms of criminal elements until peace is restored in the country. He made the comments during a visit to personnel of the Quick Response Force in Minan, Niger State where he was represented by the Deputy Director Operation Headquarters, Air Commodore Stephen Aneke. On the international scene, South Africa has begun a week of mourning for Reverend Anti-Apartheid campaigner Archbishop Desmond Tutu. The Nobel Peace Prize laureate passed away on Sunday, aged 90, stripping the world of a towering moral figure and the last great protagonist of the heroic South African era. And in sports, Cameroon football legend Samuel Eto owes nearly 1 million euros in taxes from his time in Spain, according to authorities in the European nation. The 40-year-old, who earlier this month was elected president of the Cameroon Football Federation, appeared on a list published by the Spanish tax office of people and companies that owe over 600,000 euros. And that's the evening news recap. Visit channelstv.com for details on these stories and more. I'm Melissa Walker. Thank you for watching.